Alright guys, I'm here picking up the Q60. It's finally done getting the airlift performance 3P kit installed. With my buddies over here at Airride Equipment and Redlands. Um, just from looking at the car right now, <laughs> looks fucking sick. So, I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys, introduce, introduce you guys to Ray and Sal who installed. And just check it out real quick. Damn. Which one? Oh yeah, it's clean. Damn. Gee. That thing's bad. <laughs> Damn. This is Ray's car right here. Clean beamer. I still can't get over mine. This is crazy. This is the guy who started it all. Started off the whole shop. It's out here in Redlands, California, guys. Check him out. Give you guys sweet deals, lifetime warranty. Damn. Is that an R8? What? I didn't even notice that. That's so clean. Got Sal's car right there. I think he just got it wrapped from their matching in the story. On their Instagram, guys, check them out on their Instagram. Air right equipment. I'm gonna go meet up with Ray and do the payment process. I don't know if I can hear you. I feel like just naturally I can see back pretty far. Yeah. Hey, what's up, you guys? What's, what's up, up, man? How you doing, man? What's up, sir? How you doing? What's up, bro? All right, man. The car looks amazing, dude. How was it? It was all good? It looks amazing, man. Yeah, it's fucking fabulous. Yeah, I didn't even want to tuck that much, dude. Perfect. There you go. So that's your right high freezing. Okay. If you press uh, next above it, this the one? Air lift, double tap. The airlift one? Next one. Where? Right yeah, double tap. You go a little bit higher. Oh, okay. The speed bumps and all this stuff. Yeah, yeah. Oh, wow. Right. Okay. If you press air lift one again, the airlift double one? tap. This one? Drops a little bit. But if you see in the front is not dropping it, yeah. you get the design of the air lift. Uh, the bags on the front, let's the sleep bag, uh, always works perfect from the bottom to the top. Okay. So it's the only issue in that kind of air lift. Okay. Okay, double tap, bottom and air lift. Okay. Double tap. Here, half. Can you see in the front it's uh, dropping bad? Yeah, because yeah, the sleeve. Oh, okay. So when you're in air out, to go right height, all the time go the same in the height because it's pushing up. Okay. When you're down, it's not going the same. What is this one for, the bottom one? It's air out, but let me explain to you something. Because in the front, it's already max compressed. Your control arm and uh, airbag is max compressed. But you still have 60 PSI in the air. Mm. So the deep airbag, if you leave uh, some air on it and you start racing up, go quick. Oh, faster. Okay, yeah. okay, okay. If so. you go zeros, you can go zeros. But if you're lift, because it's in zeros, mm -hmm. it take a little bit longer to raise up. Okay. But you can go zeros. This one? Yeah. Let's press and hold. Oh. That one is press. There you go. So it's not dropping because it's already, it's already slammed. Yeah. Slammed. So okay. if you press air lift, double tap. Take a little bit too far on okay. the front. This is right height, huh? Yeah. Okay. All right, cool, man. Oh yeah. So you can go that one, but it's like a wasting here. Yeah, yeah. Because you go zero. Yeah, and I could leave that overnight, right? I could let it like not zeros, but the 60, 60 front. Yeah, you I could can leave, leave it overnight. it overnight like that. You can leave it zeros overnight. You can leave it in air. You can leave it in anywhere. It's okay. It's not affected or anything. Yeah. Oh, oh so that's your setup. 
So your drain you see right here? Yeah, yeah. You need to drain once a week. Once a week, Every so how do you do it? Just pull it out? Just pull it out. Okay. So you need to come back to 500 mile return inspection is required. Okay. Next uh, day available uh, next week. Next week, okay, so cool. just stopping by. Uh, take me 10 to 15 minutes to check everything mm -hmm. and I show you how to do it for first time Okay, and after cool. that you can do it on your own every Friday. Okay, cool. So I could come back next week, right? Yep. All right, I'll just text you or I'll text uh, right? I'll just get stopping by. Stop by? Okay, yeah. cool. Awesome. Monday to Friday, 8 to 4 30. I'm here all the time. Awesome. All right. Thank you so much, Sal. All right. All right, let's do it. Let's do a test drive. All right. Want to come, babe? Want to come for a test drive? Want no, it back? On the front. It's okay. <laughs> yeah. I know, huh? Here, you record. Uh, record it. Alright. Sorry, man. <laughs> no, that's fine. The whole installation itself was easy, huh? Uh, yeah, yeah, it's easy. Just on the rear, it's time consuming because you need to take every single poster stuff oh, out okay, because yeah, yeah. the top of the strut. The strut. Did you have to take the back seat down and everything? No. No. Just oh, the okay. Posturing. Yeah, the same design of the suspension, like uh, G35s, oh, like okay. uh, GTR. Yeah, yeah, all the Nissans, right? Yeah, it's the only. So yeah, I haven't drove, a, I haven't drove a lowered car in like a while. Oh yeah. <laughs> yeah. Well, I heard the rattle noise at the end. Yeah, it's big sauce. Yeah, yeah. I was making sure I didn't want you to think like, oh, it's a bag or something. I was like, yeah. Yeah. Oh man, this truck's good. Yeah, and the back is all soft, the okay. stiffness. Yeah, yeah. And uh, the front is like a uh, ten clicks. If you wanna go more straight, if, oh, straight, okay. If you wanna go more stiff, you can step on the front. But oh, on the okay. rear, it's all soft, but it still is stiff because the design of the straight. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. Strike. And this car is more heavier than the front. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yeah, but the dampening for the rear struts is right there next to the. When you hook the car seat, yeah, yeah, yeah right there is the oh, extension okay. because it's super hard to, to get in there. Yeah, oh, it feels like it feels good. It feels like now I want to say like stock, like stock suspension. Yeah. It feels like like it's it, more. Yeah, it feels smooth. Like it just yeah, because yeah. I I had a coilover before my on the record, and that that was rough. It was really hard. And then um, I got I've always been springs. I've always had springs and springs, man. They're they're horrible. They you hit something, it's like boom, boom, boom. <laughs> it was it was cheap, you know. You could feel the, the difference on this one between yeah. the springs. Yeah, like I said, you can adjust your right head. It's not necessary. Leave it in that preset. Yeah, yeah. But as soon as you feel comfortable to do it, to do it, to raise it up or lower, with yeah, the yeah. You want, I want you to do it. Any adjustment you do from the bottom to up. Okay. Okay. Never adjust from up to bottom because when you're um, activate or, or use the presets, it's always from the bottom to up to the right. Right. Yeah, so always I tell the customers don't do it like that because it's uh, the presets never go the same. Oh, okay, okay. So, um, so return car off. The other off. thing, like right now, uh, you need to learn to park with the straight wheels all the time if you want to drop. Oh, okay, because if you have sideways, it gets... Yeah, yeah, yeah. you smash your fender, so you're on run to your fender. Okay. So, if you want to park it, just... Okay. Uh, if you want to air out, just air out first. Double tap this one. Harder. Okay. And you can turn your car and your switch up. And the switch is right here. All right there. Cool. Back. Um, I got the car. I went to go eat, went to the gym, uh, watched the car. Fucking, I'm stoked, I'm happy. It airs out perfectly. It does everything perfect. The ride's smooth. It's a little bumpy, but it's because it's stiff in the front. Um, and it's just, it's amazing. It's an amazing ride, I love it. But here's the car right now. Let me get a little closer view. I just got done washing it. I went to those little cheap, you know, car wash stations. Checked it out. This is it right now. It's on 60 PSI in the front, zero in the back, but 60 is enough to flat it, like lay it all the way down. This is it right now. You can see it's like, look at that. So low, love it. I need to get better car washing stuff up to do it here. Yeah, this is it right here. Oh, the pride is all done. Look at that. 
It's moving from the front. This is it. All, all left now is just get rid of all that chrome, carbon hood, black out the roof, carbon trunk. And I'm just trying to get, I'm trying to decide on what exhaust I want. So, because right now it's just straight piped, resonator delete, muffler delete. That's all it is right now, guys. I'm out here with the pups, and my girl. Just relaxing, chilling. Probably can go back to the gym to be honest with you guys. I just want to drive it, honestly. Super stoked for it. So, yeah, guys. Sorry. Yeah, guys, that's it. Super happy. My girl's a little, she's a little uh, biased on it because, you know, she doesn't, she likes coilovers, springs. I, I'm, I just wanted to do bags, so I got bags. Huh, babe? <laughs> Tell me your opinion, babe. <laughs> But yeah guys, so that's it. That's the end of this video. Small video, short video. Just me picking up my car after I got bagged. But um, this weekend I got two car meets to go to. So I'll be vlogging all of those, showing you guys all the cars, checking it out. It's Dustin Williams Legends Media Meet. TJ Hunt's gonna be there. Uh, he's gonna have his merch there. I'm, I'm hoping he has his merch there. It's a $15 toy drive, so you guys should check it out and go. It's gonna be fucking awesome. See you guys there. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, like the video, and leave a comment down below. There'll be more content for sure. Thank you guys.